Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Ina and today I'm going to share with you three practical tips of how to lose weight in a week. And some of them could be very new to you and it's definitely not drinking water or drinking more water or any of that stuff. It's actually going to be very practical and something that can help most of you, I mean, I'm not a doctor obviously, but this could help you lose weight or you finally, if you want to lose some weight. All right, so number one tip I'm going to share with you guys is the fact it's actually salt. And here is the thing about salt. The thing is when you eat foods with like a lot of salt, you want to eat more. So the opposite of it, if it's that the same exact food has either zero salt or way less salt, you will literally eat way less. I had that experience, so I did um, chicken drums. I mean, I love chicken drums. So what I did, I just boiled them. I did not salt them at all. I just put them in boil. I'm like, I'm going to eat this as my whatever, you know, side dish, meat dish I'm eating that week. So I just boiled the drumsticks, did not add a single <laughs> thing of salt. And you guys, I was eating like one and a half or one and I was like, I am done, done with that drumstick because of how I mean, tasteless it is. You're getting your protein, but you literally, because it is so tasteless, you're you're done. You're literally going to eat half the amount of food you usually eat because it has no salt. So literally, if you want to gain weight, add more salt, you're gonna want to eat, eat something way more than usual. So just cutting down on the salt amount when you're cooking, cook your pasta. Do not add salt. You will see, you will see how less of food you need to eat to feel satisfied. Try it out. Just try it out. No salt, even pasta, even whatever your favorite thing is. Adding salt makes the biggest difference of being satiated faster and feeling that you do not want more of that food. So less food you eat, the faster you will lose weight for that food. So, you know, it's a win-win situation. I mean, I would definitely not recommend cutting um, salt completely out because that's what I kind of did and it did make me feel very, very tired. I wouldn't recommend that, but just uh, have salt a little bit, like drastically different when you usually do. And that would really help you with uh, losing some weight that you've been wanting to lose weight for a while. All right, tip number two is cutting out sugar cold turkey while you're doing this diet. Just because it is, it, sweets have so, so much calories that you do not want and, and that preventing you from losing that weight because, I mean, the sodas, all these things, just cutting them out, you will be craving less of. In like a few days, you will literally want to think of that same sweet, too sweet for you. And this way, it will help you lose weight because you're not eating as much sweets. So my, I mean, my favorite thing is going cold turkey and not eating those sweets. But I also want you to wait till the end because I am going to share with you what to eat at night to help you lose weight. I think it's so cool because you can eat something at night and it will work in your system to burn calories while you sleep. I mean, who does not want that? That literally helps you lose weight even faster. So keep that in mind, watch till the end. But 
definitely sugar cutting it out helped me lose stop eating all the sugary snacks that week and you can still eat your fruits fruits you can that's the thing you you if you will have a craving for your sugar go ahead eat some fruits it's not out of the question it's not like zero sugar in your blood but uh, oh yeah do not drink juices at any any kind because juices skyrocket your insulin and ins when your insulin rises it prevents you it gives you the body at the action to turn whatever he, they're um you know dissolving insulin uh to keep it as a fat so you do not want to do that so drinking an orange juice versus eating a whole orange this one will give you weight gain and this one won't because the insulin did not rise as fast and did not tell your body to turn things into fat, whatever you're eating. So definitely think about that. Just don't do juices that week. It will really help you lose weight. And finally, the tip number three is the things that you can eat at night to lose weight. And I'm not sure if you ever heard of them. So that uh, number one food you want to eat before you go to bed, and it's recommended that you actually eat it before you go to bed, minimum like 30 minutes before. And that is egg whites just egg whites no egg yolks but just egg whites and you're gonna eat about two egg whites one or two two egg whites at night you're gonna eat them go to sleep and you will wake up lighter i mean usually you do lose weight at night but eating egg whites there's something in the egg whites that helps you or the body to kick in that fact burning process. You will see that difference right in the morning. So I highly recommend that. Just do this test for yourself. Also, second fruit you want to eat at night is kiwi. Eating kiwi one or two at night and that also turn in your body into fat burning process. So you want to eat a one kiwi or two at night as your snack, whatever you um, like a night snack, and you will wake up lighter. So why not boost your weight loss that week and help you lose that unwanted fat, right? We all want this. We all, this summer is coming up and we all want to look good. So I hope you enjoy these tips that I gave you. Try them out uh, if it's safe, safe to do so for you. I mean, uh, talk to your doctor if any of this, I mean, if you have allergies on that or all sorts of things, but you could definitely try these out and see for yourself how different and how much food, like just cutting out salt will make a difference on your body. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like this, subscribe, and comment below what diets helped you to lose weight and what you think about this diet. I'll see you in the next video.